everyone, my name is Kate the Animal Hunter. Today we're going to be exploring the African savanna. It's April, the start of the rainy season. But today's nice out. Let's go see what animals are taking advantage of the nice weather. Look, there's a dick tick. It's a dick tick. A dick tick is a small antelope. It gets its name from the sound and makes one dangerous again. This one isn't alarming, but watch this. Hyenas and lions. Did you see that? That's a black flame. Black flames are very dangerous. Let's go see if we can get a closer look. Flames are called black flames because of their similar look to a flamingo. But there's, but that's where the similarities end. You see a black flame out during the day because they are nocturnal, meaning they can hunt at night. This helps it preserve water in its hot environment. They have black on their bottom, have to match the sky at night and yellow on the top half to match the grasslands. They blend in well. This helps them avoid predators and find their next meal. Oh no, the black flame is getting close to this person's house. Let's go warn them. Hello? Ma'am, you should know that there's a black flame in your front yard. Please be careful. Oh, thank you so much for letting me know. Excuse my appearance. I just got out of the shower and I'm getting ready to do some mopping, but thank you, honey. Bye. Bye. Okay guys, now that we warned everyone, let's go get some distance. This flame has adaptations to help them get food. As it flies overhead, it is invisible because it blends in. It swoops down and catches small creatures with its sharp claws and sharp teeth. And can fly away again without staying in one spot too long. It truly has adapted well to living in this ecosystem. Well guys, that's all we have for today. If you like this video, like and subscribe for more.